it's Tara and today I am doing a review on Lab Partners Cleo de Nile and Gulia Yelps from Monster High. This is the Mad Science collection and it's really cool because it has a lot of accessories for doing science type scenes so I'm really excited to see those. And I haven't had Gulia yet so I'm very excited to have her as part of my collection. I really love her blue hair. And then I don't mind having another Cleo because I really love Cleo. She is definitely one of my favorite Monster Highs. And I really love these two science themed outfits. Very cool. So I'm so excited to open. On the back side there's a beautiful caricature of the two girls. And then experiment notes. So let's get her op let's get these two open and out of the box and see what they look like. I must say that Cleo does not look anything like my other Cleo. Her face is very very different, especially if you put take off her glasses. So let's start with Cleo Denial. She has fabulous gold glasses. These are safety glasses for her science project. She has very interesting eyes. She has very dark red, like a maroon colored lipstick on. Her hair is mostly black. It's a little bit uneven on the bottom. She has the green and purple streaks in her hair. The eyeglasses have kind of wrecked her hair um, and they've put a ton of gel in the upper part of her hair so it like sticks down to her head. But her face just looks really different than the other Cleo that I have and the other Cleos that I've seen in the store. So she looks very different. I, I would say she looks kind of like a sister of Cleo instead of a, uh, instead of the same doll. We'll definitely have to fix this hair though. Look how uneven it is. Goodness grief. But I really like her face. Um, it looks very human to me. And her hands as well. I really like her hands. Oftentimes, um, Monster High has like hands that are in um, different poses and stuff. But I like this hand the most. It's the most human-like. And so overall, she just looks like a normal, like, human. She doesn't look like a monster at all. And I love her dress. I love the lab coat. Which has a print on the sides. Yellow mummy fabric. Very cute, and she has these very interesting leg warmers. Very Cleo styled, and I love these sandals. These are so cute. I want them for myself. Way too cute. All right, so that is my detailed look at Cleo. Now let's move on to beautiful Gulia. So here is Miss Gulia Yelps. She has adorable white glasses, of course. I think that is one of her signature things. I love the two-tone blue hair that she has. Her hair is in a little bit better condition than Cleo's. Um, I really like the earrings. that They both have the same earrings. It's just um, Gulia has red and Cleo had gold. And they are little squares from the periodical table of elements. She is also wearing a dress that has a print of the same thing the table of elements on it. I really, really like that detailing. And then she has um, a very cool red print for her collar and sleeves. And then she's wearing like high-heeled tennis shoes. Very cool. I absolutely love the lab coat that they came in. Very stylish. She also wears a headband. So that is Gulia 
for the accessories, it came with a whole bunch of beakers. This one, you can have it um, not exploding, or you can add a piece to it and it'll make it look like it's exploding on the top. Pretty cool, and it has a skull detail on it. Then, of course, the standard brush. It also did come with two stands. Then it has these two beakers that are connected. Pretty cool. And then two more science themed things. And then this. I think it's their science notes, experiment notes, that kind of thing. Pretty cool. All right, so that is my review on this Yelps and Miss Denial. I hope you really liked this review and make sure to comment down below your thoughts. Thank you guys so much for watching. Have a great day. Bye.